COVID-19 continues to have a financial impact on businesses all over, forcing some stores, as we just mentioned, to file for bankruptcy. So what does this mean for you if you have gift cards to these places that you still haven't used? Consumer investigator Lindsay Bramson's always watching out for your money and found out what you need to know. It's one of the best gifts you can get, a gift card allowing you to pick out what you want. But if it's a card to one of the many stores that have closed during COVID-19, you have some homework to do. Make sure they read the terms and conditions to see if in fact they are, the value never changes. You can usually find this information on the back of the card. You also want to check to see if there's an expiration date. Most gift cards never expire. And under federal law, when there is a Chapter 11, the consumer has up to five years to file a claim to recoup those dollars. There are two types of bankruptcy a company might file for, Chapter 7 and Chapter 11, which is a bit more forgiving to a consumer. Chapter 7, on the other hand, leaves it up to the courts to decide if you get any of that money. Pier 1 is closing all of its stores because of coronavirus. Bath & Body Works is closing 50 stores and JCPenney more than 200. But don't worry, you should still be able to use those gift cards online. And the sooner you do it, the better. Because you just don't know what the status of that business is going to be down the road. And so we really recommend never holding on to gift cards. Something else you want to watch out for, unsolicited emails. If someone emails you asking you to use your gift cards, that's most likely a scam. Lindsay Bramson, News 4 Nashville.